Yo, and welcome back to some more Dark Souls 3. So, you remember last time we got the Warrior of Sunlight medal. Which, uh, basically, uh, allows us to become a Sunbro. In the Sunbro Covenant. Boom. Boom. Yeah, this works. I'm sort of lunging. There you go. That's great. I don't have to do anything drastic about that. Oh god. Oh my god, you hit so fucking slow. Oh my god, man. I really hate you. Just for personal reasons. You know, I tried parrying him, but it didn't work that well. Oh my god, yeah. Forgot about you guys. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. I fucking hate them. Yeah, a lot. There you go. Uh, and you, straight in the back. That's how it's done. And that is how we are going to prevail. Uh, and again, and again, and again. So I can just keep hitting him at a reasonable range. Like that, oh god. Like that, like that, and like that. Did he die? Yes, he died. That's what I like to see. Man, this place is a bit tricky, uh, I guess you could say. Because there is a fat woman up there throwing no, no miracles at me. There you go. Nope, hit him. There we go. Good boy. What did I get? I got the thrall hood. Hell yes. There we go. Look how snazzy I look now. Yeah. Look, I've got a, a head tail. That's pretty fun. Yo. There you go. You almost did it. You didn't have enough poise though. To poise through my <sighs> bleed damage. He'd get a whip though, which is a dex weapon. I mean I'm not I'm not that into the whip, it doesn't do that much damage overall. You gonna do it again? Yeah you're gonna do it again. There you go. You will never be able to outpoise my bleed, woman. That is why I need to upgrade my luck. Because it helps me a lot when it comes to that stuff. There is an item here? Nope, there's not an item. Oh, and there's Holy Knight Hodrick invading me as a mound maker. Which is uh, alright, I guess. I mean. I'm just gonna go here and casually get my items that I want. There's one up here. Oh my god, you just made my lizard run away. You absolute shithead. Come here. Oh my god, you know what? Alright, that's fine. That's alright. Just come here. I don't want to aggro the big guy. Because of you. Because you're stupid. I'm just gonna light the bonfire real casually as you make your way over here. I'm gonna. Go, go to these. And I'm gonna have those. Come here, Hodrick. You're literally brain dead when it comes to this shit. This way. Yes, great. I literally had to make you go this way. There we go. Leading you like a snake tamer or whatever they're called. There you go. You wanna, you wanna taste my R1 spam? I don't think you wanna. Because that's my R1 spam. How do you like that? Out oh, here. Oh, okay. Welp. That wasn't very fun. Oh god, he made me aggro that shit. Oh, you absolute dickhead. There you go. Fall down. Nope. There you go. And I fell down as well. Well then, I killed Hodrick, and he fell <laughs> down as well. I made everybody fall down. Oh, that was great. I did light the bonfire, though. I hope I spawn over there. Hmm, maybe, because I want my souls back. Those were like 10,000 souls or something. Yes, and Hodrick is dead. I'm just gonna ember up again. And, uh, and yes. We are now gonna go back and... Level up. That's the word. Level, level up. I think we're gonna level up a luck, maybe? 
probably, hopefully, shortly. Um, because I need to do as much bleed damage as possible. And I think it ramps up the... Uh, well, bleed damage. Well, sort of bleed damage, I don't know. Um, but the bleed chance, at least. So, like, it takes fewer hits for me to bleed them or something. Something like that. There you go. Uh, luck. 18. Maybe. I don't really know. 18. We could do 18. I then boosts my item discovery. Bleed. Bleed luck, maybe. I don't know about it. Yeah, let's make let's make a, a bleed build. Sh shall we? Sa shall we? Shall we make a bleed build? And I do have... Didn't I have a bow as well? Yeah, I did. I sort of forgot about that. S shard. Don't have any more. Reinforce... Uh, this one. It's really good. Level 3. Uh, infuse it with... Ooh, I don't know. Not refined. I think it needs to be a sharp gem. Yeah, a sharp gem. Hey, Grey Rat, I have something for you. Oh, and in one piece. Heavens, she was already dead. Thank you. No, I'm not surprised, though. Almost a relief, really. You can keep the ring as, well, a little trinket of thanks, I suppose. Well, that was sad. Goodbye. And stay safe. Thanks, Grey Rat, you too, man. Thanks, man. Man, that was sad. I don't have any ashes for you. Or you, or you, or you, or you. So, what I'm gonna do. Oh, shit, yeah, burn the undead bone shard. I don't have any. Go back to the dilapidated bridge. I need to remember something. Um. Yeah, all right. No, 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 no. We're gonna, go, we're not gonna do that because I need to do something else, and I'll be right back. All right, so we are back under the dilapidated bridge. Oh shit! What happened there? Uh, yeah, wrong way. I'm not going in there. I'm going this way because there is a way that I need to go. I'm gonna. Gonna get the this this guy right there. There we go. Bleed, 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 bleed. There we go. So that bleed was uh, increased, I guess. There we go. Take those guys and this guy. Because my knife is upgraded now, right? Uh. So yes, take the dog. Ow, you hit me. Well done. Yeah, the range on that pitchfork is amazing. I sort of want to do like a cosplay of those guys just because they are so powerful. I'm gonna run past here because that is not a place I want to be. I don't want to take her on at all. Oh god, hi there. Hi doggy. I don't want to go there. I'm gonna go down here. Into the sewers where the rats are. And these sewers really remind me of Dark Souls 1. Because you really went into the sewers really early then as well. Castus. Fist weapons, basically. Like that. And you dual wield them, and you got fist weapons. And you're a professional boxer. Ain't that fun? I sort of want to do like a boxer thing as well. A knife and Castus, maybe. Oh, hi, rat. Oh, god, rat. Would you kindly not? There we go. Bloodbite ring. What does that do again? I don't remember. Blood bite ring. Increases bleed resistance. Ah, yeah, okay. So here we go up here. We open the door and voila! We are back at this bonfire. And there's the crystal lizard that I need to get. The little cunt. Well, sit at the bonfire and try not to alert the crystal lizard. Run up here. Try not to alert this guy either. Uh, so don't, oh shit, Hodrick again. Oh, didn't I kill him? What? Come on, there we go. No, 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 no. There we go, I killed him. That's fine, that's right. Sharp gem, yes! Now I can infuse my dagger with sharp gem. 
Alright, Hodrick, round two. How'd you feel about this one? You good? You alright? Come on, man. Give me the parry. There we go. Whoop de doo. Straight in your guts. Boom, 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 Oh shit, he parried me. God damn it. Well then. You're a bit of a cuck, aren't you? I'm just gonna do this now. Ow, 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 Hodrick. Now, now. Are you out of. out of your stuff? Well, I'm just gonna do this then. Hey, okay. sit the fuck down, boy. I am better than you. Where, where, where? I can do what people cannot do well because people are not as good as me as you are not. Hue hue hue. Wasn't that a nice rhyme? Sort of, sort of a rhyme, I don't know. Uh, so yes, I'm going to just kill this guy. Dead. There you go. Yeah. You, you, you pound the ground then. You're a real ground pounder. I'm going to put my young white branch on because that allows me not to get shot by Mr. 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 Giant over there in the tower up there. Whoop! There we go. Wasn't that nice? So, yes. We are just going to take every single item that is here. And we need something here. Hmm, another young one branch. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. There you go, just kill this guy real quick. Oh shit, there's gonna be another arrow incoming. Ow. Well, hi then. There you go. I rolled pretty far then. Another worker hat. I don't want more worker hats now. I've got three. It's not like I'm freaking collecting them, is there? There you go, just heal up. I got an undead bone shard, which allows me to upgrade my Estus. That's pretty good. I guess we're gonna go up here. Get another item. There you go. Hi there. Are you having fun on the roof? There you go. Trying to ambush people. Got the cleric set. Not the mace though. Only the shield and the armor. So yes, we got some mortician's ashes. But first of all, I'm gonna go in here. Kill this guy real quick because there's an item I sort of want here. Kill this guy. I won't spam him to shit. Oh, he dropped something. Worker garb again. Hi. Like those. Those are nice. No, no. They have a nice necklace on them, at least. Great scythe. Can I use it? I cannot. I don't have enough strength. Oh well. I'm gonna go run back to the bonfire and um. And yeah, I'm gonna see you back at Firelink Shrine. Right, so we're back at Firelink Shrine and we give the ashes to this lady. Right, lady, I have a treat for you. Mortician's ashes. <laughs> well, we will see, because you are selling a uh, tower key. No. Grave key. Yes. That's what I want. Do you sell anything else? Nope. Well, cool. Yeah. And, uh, oh, poor grey rat. Poor, poor grey rat. Oh, my God, though. Heavens. She was already dead. Oh, heavens! She was already dead. Let's fix up our emotes, shall we? Point down, um, bow, and then wave and curl up. This is curl up. Ah, oh, I look just like him. We have the same armor. I just noticed the thief stuff, right? Uh, we can level up once more as well. Nope. Uh, luck. I'll get my luck up to twenty, shall we? Well, we will. Yeah, cool. Let's get back here. Burn the other bolt shard. Plus one. 
and we will go back to the dilapidated bridge. There is something I need to show you in the sewers. Thank god the sewers aren't big, like in Dark Souls 1, because the sewers there were horrible and they led to the most horrific boss in the whole game I've ever seen in a Dark Souls game or Bloodborne. It was so disturbing, you know, because you just see that little... If you know about this, then you know what I mean. You see this little crocodile head, like, go up. Like, alright, it's, it's like a little amphibian, a, li a little snake or a crocodile or something. And then you see the rest of the body emerge from the from going upwards the waterfall, right? It's basically the gaping dragon, if you've ever seen it. There we go. Killed all of them. Ah, oh, see, so, so yeah, enough about that. That gaping dragon, he's dead. He's in the past. He's pretty cool though. He's he's like the coolest boss I know in Dark Souls. He's my favorite boss. When well, I have multiple favorite bosses, you know, there's the Asylum Demon, which is the first boss in Dark Souls One, and then you have the second one, which is the Copper Demon. You know, in that small confined area, you have to fight him in with the two dogs, and then you have the. I think right after that one, you go to the sewers. In at least I did to fight the gaping dragon. So I did that as my third boss. I need to kill these skeletons real quick. There we go. So yeah, that was fun. That was good times. I'm just gonna run through here as the skeletons do uh, regenerate, which is a bit. It's, it's a bit dumb. It's a bit dumb. Hi then. Did you fall down? Really? Oh God! No! 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 I will not allow you to go away from me. Please! There we go. I killed it. Oh, you skeleton dick! I will kill you. All the time. <laughs> I will kill you all the time. And we have to be careful. Boom. Just do that. There you go. Bleed him. We got some rubbish. He was rubbish. We got his rubbish. It's a part of him. He's a part of the rubbish. Uh, and there is an item up here that we're going to get. Uh, shoot it down with my bow. I really like that the thief starts with a bow. Oh shit, we used the fire arrows. That's fine. Take back our parrying shield. That's that's good, 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 good. We got the, we got that one. Hey, actually, that's pretty good. It's uh, I can't use it though. It's got ten. I don't even have ten strength, man. But uh, but yeah, it's a shield with the blessing. Uh, it's, uh not achievement. What I'm talking about, the blessing infusion. That's the thing. Which basically just uh, heals you if you have it equipped. Just gonna uh, regenerate my stamina. Be real cool about it. I di I actually died here once with a freaking greatsword. Could you imagine that? A couple of rats not being able to die from a greatsword. Oh well, that's past me. I can do that with a small knife now. I am good at this game, sort of. Not really. Oh, hi. Hello. Uh, who is there? Someone there. Anyone? Oh, please. Whoever you are, touch me. <laughs> the dark surrounds me, nibbles at my flesh. Little creatures, they never stop biting. So please, hold out your hand and touch me. Alright, uh, that's a bit weird, but sh sure. There you are. So close, indeed. And I am not entirely alone just yet. Praise the merciful gods above. Right. Oh, forgive me. I am Irina of Karim. I came to this land so that I might be a firekeeper. Your touch has freed me from the darkness. You are a champion, then. I am weak and unfit to tend the flames. But if it would not trouble you, might I enter into your service instead? Uh, okay. Oh, thank you, sweet champion. I shall take my vows. 
I, Irina of Karim, solemnly swear to serve you. Oh, that's so nice. She's a blind woman with a problem. So her thing is, she sells you miracles if you're a cleric. Yeah. Hmm. Another one of those unkindled, are you? All you faceless undead, behaving as if you deserve respect. Now you've gone and rescued the wench. How very quaint. Pitying creatures that are beyond help. <laughs> yeah, very well. I'm sick of looking after her at any rate. I'm Egon, a knight of Karim. I am allied to you for as long as you assure the girl's safety. And only for that long. What's the matter? My terms are very simple. I am allied to you for as long and only. <laughs> Alright then, Eon, Egon, whatever your name is. Irina and Egon of Karim. So we got those back now, and she sells you either dark miracles or normal miracles. And if you only buy dark miracles, she is going to leave. Well, she's going to be moved by Egon. Because the darkness she talks about crawls on her, or something like that, when you buy dark miracles. And you help her by buying normal miracles. But hey, look at this. It is... Mm. 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 Absorbed in thought. I am Siegbert of Katarina. Siegbert of Katarina. To be honest, I'm in a bit of a pickle. Mm. Have you ever walked near a white birch only to be struck by a great arrow? Yes. Well, if I'm not mistaken, they come from this tower. Whoever it is, I'm sure I can talk some sense into them. But I have to find a way up. And that's just the trouble. This lift only goes down, you see, and... Uh, well, that doesn't get me anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. This lift, with a lift, I've got to use my... Hmm. hmm. So yeah, this lift, a puzzle. You've got to do that, and roll off. And you might say, well, it's only going down. What are you going to do now? Well, this. It's a double sided lift. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go up. Have fun then. That's great. I don't know how he's gonna get up, but uh, right now we're on our way to meet the perpetrator of the arrows, the great arrows that are shooting from this tower. But, uh, but yeah, we're gonna meet him in the next episode. I am done right now. So, uh, yeah. I'll play some more. Goodbye.